Hey guys, welcome to RC Medical Diagnostic Laboratory Service. I hope you like my video on how Siam may give you cancer. If you have not watched that video, click the link above. Thank you for your support. Today we are going to discuss hepatitis. I know you have heard of hepatitis. Stay tuned. Like, share, and comment. Hey guys, welcome back. Hepatitis means inflammation of the liver. When your liver is inflamed or damaged, its function is affected. We have viral hepatitis and non-viral hepatitis. Non-viral hepatitis can be caused by too much consumption of alcohol, some medications, and certain medical health conditions. We have main five strains of viral hepatitis. We have type A, type B, type C, type D, and E. Type B and C are the most common and the leading cause of chronic liver disease. Type B and C causes liver cirrhosis, liver cancer, and viral related hepatitis death. So type A, D, and E are rare cases. They are not common like B and C. Mode of transmission, type B, C, and D can be transmitted through contact with infected blood, infected body fluid, sexual contact, clearing of infected objects. Common symptoms of viral hepatitis. This include dark urine, yellow skin and eyes, loss of appetite, weight loss, abdominal pain. When you notice any of these symptoms listed, go for laboratory diagnosis. The laboratory diagnosis includes liver function tests and then rapid tests for the five main strains of viral hepatitis. Viral hepatitis treatment. Type A and E does not require treatment. Once you contact type A or E viral hepatitis, what you need to do is to take enough fluid, drink enough water. Type B viral hepatitis does not require treatment in acute cases, but in chronic cases, it requires treatment, and this is treatable with antiviral drug. Type D has vaccine, and it is available in the hospitals and in the health, in the health center. Type C viral hepatitis is treated in both acute and chronic cases with antiviral drugs. Type C does not have vaccine, and lastly, type D viral hepatitis can be prevented by taking type D vaccine. So when you take type D vaccine, you protect yourself from type D and B viral hepatitis. If you have any of the five strains of viral hepatitis, you need to avoid this. You need to avoid number one, alcohol. Number two, oily foods. Number three, sugary treats such as cake. Cookies, foods that contain too much salt. Also, avoid fried foods and meat. These are the diets you need to feed on. Eat plenty fruits and vegetables. Go eat whole grains. Eat fish, egg white, and skinless chicken. Eat low-fat products such as avocado and olive oil. We have come to the end of this lecture. I hope you learned something. Thank you for your support. Like, share, comment. If you are watching from YouTube, please subscribe.